Hi ladies, it's trainer Amy Jo with Athlean XX for Women. Today we're gonna do a 20 minute full body workout using dumbbells only. This is a great one you can travel with, do at home, um, take it to the gym with you as well. But when you have limited equipment, dumbbells only, this is a great one, full body, real time. Let's do it together. All right, guys, so I've got a few different weights set up um, ready for me to grab. The first one I'm gonna grab is a more of a moderate weight. Okay, I'm gonna do a combo exercise to start. So we've got 10 reps for this first one. We're gonna do an alternating press with a squat. So everything comes down, and then I'm pressing to the center as I come up to the top, alternating my arms. Deep squat and go. 10, nine, chest up, eight, let's go. Seven, six, five, four, three, deep squat, press up, two, one more, and one. Awesome. Right into a bent over row for the back. Okay, my feet are nice and narrow. I'm hinging over at the hips, and I'm rowing right into my hip bones. Let's go for 10. One, two, three, Four, keep the, the palms facing one another and squeeze your shoulder blades together. Wrap your shoulder blades around your, around a pencil, someone's finger right there. Squeeze, chest out. Two, and one more. Awesome, one. Okay, and then our third final one is right here, Arnold press. Okay, so you're gonna have your feet hip width apart, knees are slightly bent, and we're going for 10. Palms face, round and up, 10. Nine, eight, seven, rotate it up. Six, five, four, good. Press all the way up there. Push three, two more, two, last one. Push, awesome, and down, one. Great job. Okay, we're gonna go back to the pressing, the first one we did. So those are our three exercises we're gonna go through for three sets. Feet are wide, alternating, pressing to the ceiling. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Squat, press, push it. 10, nine, eight, not too fast. Seven, six. At any time too, you can change up your weights. Go a little lighter or go a little heavier if you need to. Three, two, last one. Uh, and one, Woo. All right, bent over row, hinging over at the hips. My low back is flat. My elbows are in, tucked in. My palms are facing one another, parallel weights. And go for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Keep that head in line, keep that neck straight. Support the core, support the low back. Three, let's go. Two and one, great job, good. Okay, and then our third exercise right here, Arnold presses. Feet hip width apart, slight bend in the knees, palms face you, down right in front of you and you're rotating out wide and press up, let's go. One, two, Arnold presses, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, come on, push, 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 nine, we're knocking the shoulders out early in this workout, and 10. Good work, great job. All right, take a short break. We've got a third and final set. All right, go up if you need to and wait to bring a little more challenge to this set. All right, three, two, one. Let's go. Wide squat and alternate press. Come on, last set of these. Go. Two, three, dig in. Four, five, almost there. Six, almost there. Let's go. Seven, eight, push it. Nine, one more. Sit back in it and 10. Good work. Bent over row. Feet hip width apart. Bend over at the hips. My dumbbells are parallel, palms are facing, and go, row it out. 
10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Come on, right into those Arnold presses. Last set. And go. 1, 2, right here. 3, angle it up there. 4, 5, you're almost there. Push it. 6. Seven, eight, let's go. Come on, push, 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 push. Nine, one more, all the way up. 10, yes. All right, that's our first circuit. We got that done. Awesome, awesome. We are moving on. Remember, this is full body, so we're gonna hit up a little more legs in this second circuit. We are cramming a lot of content in here. Okay, so dumbbells only. Once again, we are gonna do a stiff-legged deadlift, okay? Also known as a Romanian deadlift. Hips hinging here, your dumbbells are in front of you. I'm following my shins all the way down to my ankles and then squeezing my glutes up. My legs are straight, but they're not, the knees are not bent or not locked. They're slightly bent, okay? I'm gonna do 10, grab a little heavier weight, hinging down, let's go for 10. First exercise, second circuit, let's go. Down, 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 and pull up. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Take your time on that negative. Three, taking your time to stretch the hamstrings and the glute. Two, and last one. Here we go. Ah. One, awesome. Okay, you're gonna take it to the mat. Dumbbells down, lay on your back. You're gonna do a single leg hip raise, okay? Grab that heavy dumbbell, just one of them. If it's heavy enough for you. If you need more weight, put two on you. Okay, you're gonna lay it across your belly right here. One leg is up. We're gonna do a hip raise to the ceiling for 10. Ready and go. And I just kind of put my hand on the dumbbell so it doesn't kind of fly off. And then my other hand is here supporting me. Five more. Five, four, three, two. Get it up there. Hold it. One. Other leg. Don't forget about that hold. Let's go for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six. Barely touch the ground. Seven. You don't want to give your hamstrings and glutes a break. Eight and nine, woo, and 10, awesome. Using the dumbbell, you're gonna go right into a core. So your dumbbell is above you, and I want you to do a small crunch, okay? This isn't a sit-up all the way up, it's a crunch. Come back down, lift the shoulder blades up, right here. Up and breathe, right into the crunch. Come on, let's go. Five, let's go for 10. Up and breathe, small crunch. Be deliberate about pushing that belly button in, low back into the mat. Eight, let's go. Nine, one more all the way up, and ah, 10, reach for it. Good job. Okay, that was the third exercise. So we're gonna do three rounds. So we've gotta go back to our Romanian deadlifts, AKA the stiff-legged deadlift. Okay, grab both of your heavier weights. Feet or hip width apart, right here. Okay, feet or hip width apart. Bending over, hinging at the hips. Let's go. Down, 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 up, and squeeze the glutes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You really wanna protect your back on these. So make sure your form is good. Make sure you're feeling it in the hamstrings and the glutes. And 10, good. On your back, one dumbbell or two dumbbells, whatever is challenging to you. Single leg hip raise. Position that dumbbell right across, right over the belly button, okay? Hand here, single leg, and go. One, two, three. Push through this heel right here. You wanna keep this heel close to your glute. You get a much bigger range of motion and you're already getting a contraction because this heel is close, is having to 
uh, contract, just being close to the glute. Eight, nine, 10. Good, let's switch, other leg. Three, two, one, go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, push it up there, three, all the way up, two, and one, whoo. All right, remember we're going right into that core, that crunch, dumbbell is right above your shoulders. Okay, wrists, elbows, shoulders. Make sure we protect our joints and go for 10. One, shoulder blades up off the pad, two, three, pull the belly button in. Push that low back into the mat. Yes, good. Whoo, exhale. Eight, nine, one more. Come on, lift that dumbbell up. 10, oh man. Whew. All right, guys, good job. That was the bottom of the second. Let's go back to the top for one more round. All right, Romanian deadlifts. Three, two, one, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Keep that spine in line. Come on, two more. Stretch and squeeze up, last one. And up, right on. One dumbbell down. Single leg, hip raise, right into it. Come on, let's get stronger. Three, two, one, go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, push it, push it. Three, two, all the way up there, hip to the ceiling, hold it. One, right on, right on. Okay, other leg down and go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come on, get up there. Nine, ready to hold it. Up and hold. 10, and down. Woo! Great job. Hamstring and glute should be working, working, working. Okay, let's move into the core. Dumbbell right over the shoulders for 10. Let's go. One. Exhaling through the hard part, right? Up and exhale. <sighs> Exhaling helps contract the core. So breathing is really important when you're doing abs. Good. We are almost there. Come on, three more. Get it, push yourself. This is it. Two and finish with the circuit. Yes, good job. All right. Woo. Get some water if you need it. We've got one more circuit here. So finishing up our third and final circuit, we're gonna do a dumbbell wood chop exercise. Feet are wide. You're holding the dumbbell and your hands kind of flipped uh, uh, grip right here. Okay, we're gonna take it down to the left foot and then I'm exhaling as I'm pulling up. Core is engaged, using those legs to drive up. Very athletic movement right here. Up and breathe. I'm not bending my elbows. Okay, I'm not pulling the dumbbell in as I come down, right? I'm extending it and driving it up. Okay, we're going for 10 each side. Let's do it. Pull it up, corner to corner. Corner to corner. Last one, 10. Awesome. Okay, reminder, don't bring it in here. You wanna extend up. If it's too heavy, drop your weight down so you can have proper form. Wood chop. Alternate grip and exhale, 10. Nine, eight, full body, I love this one. Seven, and go, six, five, breathe, four, three, exhale through it. You got two more, two, last one, and one. Woo, great job. Triceps, so I'm gonna grab just a little bit lighter of a weight. We're gonna do tricep kickbacks. Hinging over at the hips, your elbows are in. We're gonna go for 10, flexing the triceps on the back. Hand squeeze, two, three, four, 
five right here. Keep your elbows in line. Six, seven. Your, your um, arm extends so it's parallel to the floor, okay? Don't bring the elbow in down here and swing the weight. You wanna extend all the way back. Let's go two more. Two and one. Great, nice job, you guys. And our very last one, we are gonna add in one more core. So on your back, we've got single leg, hand is positioned off to the side for support, and you're gonna crunch in, fold in. Elbow comes to my knee, and then I'm pushing my leg out. Let's go 10 each side. Nine, eight, seven, six, up and breathe. Five, four, three, let's go. And two, and one. Other side, place that other hand, extend it out. Support the neck right here and pull it in. 10, nine, up and in. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Come on, get up there, that's 10. Great job, all right. Take a stand back to the top of this third and final circuit. We're gonna do the wood choppers. So make sure you have a heavy enough weight that's challenging you. Very athletic movement. Feet are wide, knees and toes are pointing forward, chest is up. Okay, I'm in a reverse grip or a alternating grip here, down to my uh, left foot and extend up. 10, nine, eight, seven. You got the legs working, you got the core, you got your upper body, love these. Five, four, here we go, three more. And three, go, go, go. Two, one more, hit it. Awesome, one. Right into the, your other side, go. Down and up. 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Make sure to breathe through it. Five, four, three. Here we go. Two, and one, nice. Tricep, tricep extension. Okay, grab a little lighter weight. Triceps are a smaller muscle group, so obviously you don't wanna go as heavy on these. Bend over, right at the hips. Elbows are locked into your side, and you're extending back. Squeeze the triceps. Let's go for 10. Take your time on the way back. Okay, my elbow is parallel to the ground. There we go, there we go, good. Five more, all the way, go. Five, four, keep your neck in line. Three, and done, yes. Onto the ground. One leg at a time, 10 and 10. Hand flat, support the neck, kick it out and fold in. Let's go, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, push it, breathe it out, two, breathe it out, last one. Yes, good, other side for 10, and go. 10, nine, eight, there you go, breathe through it. Seven, fold in half, six, be deliberate every rep. Five, four, squeeze that core. Three, two, one, nice. All right, guys, final round. We can do this. Last one, we're gonna go back to the wood choppers. Make sure you have a heavy enough weight. One that's gonna challenge you. Challenge yourself right here. In three, two, one, let's go. Full body, dumbbell only. Come on, right here. Three, let's go, four, five, Six, seven, you can do this. Eight, push it. Nine, and 10. Other side, and go. 10, corner to corner. Nine, eight. Work hard. Last set. And uh, 10, oh man, whew, we are almost there. 
Kickbacks, tricep kickbacks, we're almost there. Ready? Here we go, and squeeze. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, let's go. Two, come on, all the way, and 10, yes. Finish with the abs. And a reminder, if you guys wanna add another round on these to extend this workout, add a few more reps, that is certainly encouraged. Get a little more bang for your buck. Ready, and go. 10. Add a fourth round on each one of these circuits, and that takes you really to 30 minutes. So if you even want a 30 minute workout, just add a fourth round on all of these. Get it. And there's 10. Other side, other side, go. Come on, this is it. Push that foot out, press with the heel. Two more. Last one. Nice. Woo, you did it. Bravo, bravo, great workout. Full 20 minute workout with trainer Amy Jo using dumbbells only. That was a lot of content. Hope you guys enjoyed that workout. If you are interested in more of Athlean XX for Women's programs, head on over to their website and check out what they have to offer. There is structured programs, exercise programs, nutrition programs to help you achieve the goals that you're after. So head on over there, check out some more of their programs that you can invest in yourself, right? So hope you guys have a great day. Comment below, thumbs up. I'm trainer Amy Jo. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.